Hey everyone. Hello, it's Melissa Thomas from c to c Stamping. And um, I realized that last week I wasn't able to go live and I didn't go live the week before that. Anyways, it's been a while. And I don't want you to think I've forgotten about you because I haven't. Um, <clears throat> last week, we had made the teacher night um, and I was not feeling super well last week. But I came back from backstage and I've got some beautiful swaps to show you. Um, and I just wanted to talk a little bit about the new holiday catalog that's going live tomorrow morning. So tomorrow morning at 3 a.m. Mountain Time or a.m. Central Time, you can start ordering from the holiday catalog. A few items are on back order um, and I wanted you to know that. Um, the fall paper and a few other things. Um, <clears throat> the bones die cuts. I don't know. I'll look up a list in a second. Um, but, um, if there's something you like, I would recommend you get it when you can, um, as soon as possible, because I do think there are items that will, um, go on back order. And then the ordering, like when it comes back in stock, it might be too close to Halloween, right? For instance. So hi, Pam. Welcome. So, um, George, the dog is destroying the couch. No big deal, right? Hey, calm down. <laughs> um, so let me show you these swaps that I got at Backstage last week. So Backstage was uh, our leadership event. I'm gonna make sure that I can see your comments. And um, we have um, we have the opportunity to swap with um, lots of different demonstrators from um, all across the world actually and it's really cool and so last week I um, went and swapped with um, quite a few other demos and so I want to show you those swaps many of them are holiday swaps which is awesome and they um, will really highlight I think um, how nice the the new catalog is so let me rotate this down and I'm gonna show you some of those swaps right now let me move this okay all right, just moving a few things off my desk because I am working on some um, I'm working on some fall stuff right now. So I've got the new ribbons out, and it's very exciting. Okay, so let's see. My swaps came home kind of in a mess, but it's okay. <laughs> All right. All right. So some of them are from the holiday catalog and some of them are not. Hey, George. No, stop. No, thank you. He stole one of my projects the other day, um, which was lovely. So for instance, this is um, the Ships Ahoy, um, and this set is in the annual catalog, but I don't have a sample from it, and so I was really excited to get to see it. The ship is actually a lot larger than I thought it was, so pretty cool. So that's a neat sample. Um, love this. This is also not annual catalog. I mean, this is an annual catalog, not holiday, but I loved it. And you guys know I love this. I just hadn't seen the paper layered this way, and I thought it was a really nice sample. I have this stamp set, and I haven't done anything with it, and I like how clean this is. So this is um, embossed, this back white piece, but it's very clean, um, easy stamping. Love that little brushed brass butterfly on there. That was a really nice sample. And sometimes the contact info for the maker is in here, and sometimes it's not. In that case it wasn't which is a shame this one is also annual catalog and I haven't gotten a chance to see it and so I thought this was super cute <clears throat> love this boy set I think this is a really fun stamp set so this is a fun fold that we've been kind of playing around with in different variations where the card base comes to here and then this is kind of a piece of DSP so that's nice and you know I like that paper the ice cream, which is super fun in this shimmer paper. So I thought that was kind of cool. And then a cute little silver spoon. Although I don't know about you, I don't eat it with a spoon if it's in a cone. But holy guacamole, who doesn't love <coughs> 
and I didn't get, I hope you saw the sample that I put on social media, but someone put the mustache from this set on the new little die that cuts out the candy corn. It was a mustache candy corn. It was amazing. Oh, the monkeys just swinging by to say happy birthday. Super cute. Love this card because I don't have a lot of masculine and I don't do a lot of masculine, but this is a needed card. I think that there are a lot of, um, this is a really nice, this is I think some of the star DSP even. And then it has some of that shimmer paper here and here. It's actually really nice, nicely layered. I like the little torn edge at the top. It's a cool card. It's a really nice layout. Love that. Nice and clean using those. I don't know what those are. Hexagons, maybe? I do have this set, and I will be doing some things with this set that you are in my heart. Um, this is the cute little thermos. You'll definitely see. You'll see this for sure. And this actually features the, this is in the holiday catalog. And it actually has, she actually used the, um, there's a new embossing folder that comes in the minis and it has these circles. It's a little hard to see, but they're like different shaped circles in the background. It's actually a really cute sample. And then you're the pick of the patch. This is a super cute stamp set. Um, and then this is gorgeous with the fall and the fall paper. birthday. This one's super cute. Super fantastic. Mega news. Another fall card with those leaves. Um, and I'll be doing a little project with that. I'll show you guys that. Um, probably tom well, tomorrow afternoon, probably because tomorrow night we'll be gone for Girl Scouts. So cute little strawberry lemonade. Thought that was cute. Some birthday, cute, fun. This is a really pretty sample and features that embossing folder, the hybrid embossing folder that embosses and die cuts at the same time, which is pretty amazing. This is that beautiful pot, but I, I think this one's really simple. Like it relies on the DSP and the stamps and it's got a little less of the die cutting, which I really like. It's actually a really nice card. I like, I love monochromatic cards. Oh, and this one's very fancy. I could feel how thick it was, so I knew it was fancy. So it says, with a grateful heart today and every day. And then it opens and it's like, so pretty. So pretty. Squeeze box fun fold card. Susan Campfield. So, um, super, super nice card. Love the little pumpkins. They're cute. Pick of the patch. Here's that ribbon that I was just showing you. And then some, you know, fall paper, but then also just stamped, you know, pieces. This one's pretty. It uses uh, some masks in the background. That uses that one bloom stamp set. Nice brushing there. Um, so that you, you know, using those blender pens. Love this little fold where you can see both, both sides of the paper. This is a six by six and it's origami folded. There's some videos on this. This is pretty cool. This is fun. This is a new paper and a new stamp. Um, and this paper has like four seasons of flowers. It's actually really pretty. Really pretty with the um, wise men. I like this because it doesn't have the crush piece. So, or it doesn't have the kind of like barn piece. So this is actually a really nice adaptation. Cute little polar bears. This was pretty, using that background, that purple background stamp, and uh, really pretty, purple Christmas card. This is a book from the Bird's Eye View, and then it features that Swiss dot, and then she did strips of paper behind it. It's, this is a crazy detailed card. Super great for our teacher friends, though. 
love the Have a Holly Jolly Christmas. I think this was, oh yeah, Jennifer Cotton. Yeah. She always does nice work. Oh, this one was pretty too. Swinging Santa card. So this actually has a little ornament. <laughs> Hard to see, but he is a little ornament. I thought that was super cute. So that moves back and forth and you can like detach it and use it as an ornament. Fun little fold there. Pretty leaf card. I have this stamp and I haven't used it yet. So I need to use it. I think this is a really fun kind of technique that she did kind of a wash in the background. And of course, a silly goose card, cause why not? So. Lots of fun inspiration. The holiday catalog goes live tonight. Um, there are some special release papers, five papers that we have gotten to see a video of, but we don't even have our hands on yet. And I, um, I know that ornament is so creative. Um, so tomorrow, make sure you go. There will be a kit as well. Um, I recommend when you go to the online store, you hit the new button and just look for new because you'll see lots and lots of new things. Um, so let me know if you have any questions. I do have a host code going. I'll post it in the comments and um, the description here tonight and later on. And uh, just wanted to say thank you guys. Thanks for hanging with me. I know I've gotten most of my catalogs out. If you don't have a catalog and you want me to drop one off or deliver them, thanks Pam, um, then um, let me know and I'm happy to get you a catalog. Um, but otherwise, we'll see it all tomorrow. There's a new kit, a Christmas card kit, the new special release papers, and then of course, all the ha holiday catalog excitement. So happy to drop it off for you, no problem. Uh, and I'll say goodnight. Bye y'all, see you tomorrow.